bisa dawai di cobaan kita. Nanti dawai kan sebenarnya ngalak armen. Masuk tuh apa? Ini kita dawai jom di cobaan kita. Kita 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 rekam. Nanti kan sebenarnya kita nak tajam menu menu di Papua. Menurut sih dawai ini doktor kita. Ya, sawan. Hanya hasil tren hospital. Doktor A kita, dia, Pak kita, kawan cincin cincin. Haba penpau hak rancan social media. U Menteri Rangba kejela Konrad Kongkal Sangma ulang bagai long kesi bangsa kenmau hak history jong kejela. Bad ulah penting kena bagai sorkar jela rengkat bad kat tenat kol kila peniu hak jing bed bantik doyong dah kejing start science hak jela. Kebat tak lakam mereka rukom tik doyong ke baju penjulur yang kemaryang. Bad bad penting kena bandan kejing kio hak yo kekot hak jela. Ke controller of kol. Kesorkar India bagi terai par doyong kile so ya lai teli kesos kular. Bagin sedang ti doyong haki lai teli kejaka haki bukan top ya ke pendeng syalang ha West Kasi Hills, ka Saring Kham ha East Jantia Hills, bat ka Lom Yaki wa Sarang ha East Jantia Hills. Kila dan ruk sekat ar teli ke application ke beran mentah ha pedang kejing bisyar benia, ban yuk kejing menjur, ban sedang ya ke jing ti doyong da kerukom jong kejing start science. that uh, we have now got the final approval to open the mines. So now the miners are free to, these three miners can open the mines and start their mining whenever they want. They can start tonight, they can start tomorrow, it's up to them. Every election we hear, the ritual of coal mining activities, hmm. is it not an election gimmick, no election coming, Uh Yes, uh, because people ask, what's happened to the coal mines? So we have to answer back. So. One, you may say it's a gimmick, but then it's a reply here to give back to the people. Now, from our, from our point of view, even yesterday, as I said, you can see from the press conference uh, that was held there and the updates that I've put, that uh, all the necessary permissions now have been given. And now the concerned individuals uh, who have got the uh, permissions to start the mining can start today, tomorrow, day after, next week, anytime they want. So uh, I repeat again that uh, this entire procedure was very, very, very tedious and very, very complicated and was highly uh, challenging for us. Uh, previous governments could not decide on how to move forward with due respect. I'm not trying to say they didn't do anything. Of, it was a difficult decision, to be very frank. But uh, we decided to, in a way, you know, bite the bullet. And we went ahead and we challenged the Supreme Court. We got the stay. Uh, we got the ban lifted. After that was done, I can again repeat, we had to go to coal ministry to create special provisions to allow, you know, mines owned by our people to be then mined and licenses and permissions to be given. So complete new SOP had to be prepared specifically for Meghalaya. Once that was done, then after that, the necessary permissions for multiple departments and ministries of government of India and, state, and central agencies and state government had to be taken, maybe 20, 30 of them. And this would be done for the first time. So in every... Uh, ministry, every uh, central agency, state government, some hurdle, some question, some clarification used to keep come up because it never happened. So all of this took more time than one could imagine. So now, as I said, uh, final thing with the code ministry we had gone uh, with all the necessary permissions from all the different agencies and departments. And this is what has been now uh, placed in front of thing uh, of the ministry. And that is what yesterday we got the clearance. As I said, now, uh, the miners are free to start. Miners means these three miners, not, not anybody else. These three miners who have received the clearance can start mining. So now it's up to them when, when they want to start the mining.